It's Tuesday, the 4th of April. From the capital of Amman, these are the stories that are making tonight's headlines. Amman's Royal Police Coast Guard experienced a 71% spike in search and rescue missions in 2016, according to a report by the Royal Amman Police. The ROP said it conducted 216 missions, up from 126 in the year before. Last year, 172 cases of drowning were reported to the authorities, and 149 individuals were saved. British Prime Minister Theresa May defended the UK's foreign policy during a visit to Jordan, saying maintaining links in the Middle East was important for trade and security. May defended the UK's ongoing support for Saudi Arabia despite criticism of the military campaign it has waged in Yemen and said a good Brexit deal for Britain would be good for the rest of Europe. At least 10 people have been killed when an explosion tore through a train carriage in the St. Petersburg metro system yesterday, Russian authorities have said. 20 more people have been injured in what authorities have called a probable terrorist attack. Initial reports were of two explosions, but was later confirmed to be one in a tunnel in between the stops. For the latest updates on what's going on, why don't you log on to our award-winning website at timesofoman.com. <laughs>